This is a quick song. I'm gonna pull out the banjo for it. But it's no ordinary banjo. It's a spooky banjo! <laughs> <laughs> so, this song is another scary spooky song. It's about ghosts. What better time for a song about ghosts than at Halloween season, right? So you ever wonder how ghosts become like different power levels, like poltergeists and just regular spirits, or, you know, whatever. The ones that cause a lot of trouble, smashing things, and the ones that really can't do anything, so stand there and look creepy, right? So what's the difference? Well, I got to thinking one day, maybe there's different power levels that ghosts have, right? So maybe if you're cremated, you have more power than if you're just buried and you're tied to that body, right? So this is a story about a ghost who is cremated and had a tragic death, so he's like working off of two things, and he gains power over the other ghosts. He's like a ghost superhero. It's called The Ghost the Ghosts Fear the Most. came to. I was far from the wreck of the grove. I was at the crematorium with the man run in the stove. Well, I reached out to grab the man whose work kept him so trim. But when my hand met his shoulder, I just passed right through him. Then I noticed the guest list as I began to turn and the ring in the dust where they had placed the urn. It had finally happened. Yes, I finally met my end. Doomed to walk the earth until time started up again. Yeah. So I made my way home to give one last goodbye When I heard a cry of terror from the old Stanley place walking by Now they say that place is haunted and they say it kinda soft Careful so the spirits they don't move from loft to loft Seeing that I could go unnoticed, I thought I would check in Since those old Stanley folks had been as close as kin But when I walked in, I could not believe what I had saw Two specters had Miss Stanley frightened and huddled against the wall yeah. They were two spirits of thieves who died in jail and buried in the cemetery when winter's air got stale. Well, they looked at me in amazement when I told them to get lost. Well, they would be sorry that our paths had ever crossed. They both laughed aloud and said, ghosts can't do each other harm. And to prove it, one walked up and stuck his hand right through my arm. It was then I threw a punch just to double check his test. And my fist had landed hard against his face as if it was still flesh. And then the other attacked. But it was all in vain, and soon they were scared off from the beating I had laid. And I started to wonder why I was so differently made. And I realized they were buried and I was released by the flame. Yeah. So there must be something special about a fire after death. Instead of wasting good space for an eternity's rest. So if you're some lowly dirt muncher haunting those who can't defend, know that I'm the ghost, ghosts fear the most, and you best not test that trend. Ha! Ha 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 ha! We're we're cooking now! We're spooky cooking now! That song is called Ghost That Ghosts Fear The Most. I hope you liked that one. It's on my album Lost Keys and Lounge Strange. Cheers to you out there. <laughs> All right. I love you guys. Cheers. I hope you have a spectacular evening.